Hi, thanks for joining us. Uh, I'm Sue Tarrant. I'm the managing editor of I Care Business Magazine. I'm here at Transitions Academy in Orlando, Florida. I'm with Sherry Ann James, uh, who is the Vice President of Marketing for Transitions. We just finished up Academy. Uh, we just uh, did the awards presentation. Great, pro uh, great day. Uh, great two days, actually. Um, Transitions hosted about 500 ECPs, uh, representatives from labs, as well as uh, lens companies. And retail. And retail. And retail. Detail. Um, so briefly, if you could just let us know sort of the purpose of Transitions Academy, why you bring us all down here. So Transitions has always believed in partnerships and Academy represented a great forum to really celebrate that. We are very far up the distribution chain and we rely to get to the consumer through our partners, whether it's the same aforementioned lens casters, independent eye care professionals, labs, retail, and so this is an event that celebrates them, that empowers them, and, and inspires them to carry our message to the consumer. And it does, uh, judging by all the comments that I've gotten, that I've uh, uh, overheard and gotten directly uh, in the past couple of days, you're succeeding. Oh, thank <laughs> People you, got thank very you. inspired. Thank you. Um, now, a lot of times, uh, Transitions Academy is used to launch a new technology. Mm -hmm. um, this year, however, um, your your message to the attendees was sort of twofold. It was uh, Transitions' efforts this year to reach out to a uh, younger, that all important younger consumer, uh, as well as hitting home the fact that that uh, Transitions lenses do in fact uh, filter blue light. Um, so uh, if you could just let us know sort of in general how Transitions is planning to reach out to that younger consumer. Sure, and just to address the launching of a new product, sometimes innovation comes in different ways, right? It, it's a physical launch of a new product, but sometimes it's just embracing an opportunity at the right time and as more and more consumers particularly younger consumers engage in this multiple device lifestyle with our tablets with our iPhones with our computers um, we're actually exposed much more to blue light than we would be in the past and we recognize that the blocking of the blue light is innate to transitions whether you're indoors or outdoors it's actually filtering or blocking blue light and we wanted to really leverage that message in this time now where people's lifestyle really make that need. And the fact that it's not well understood that blue light is a hundred times more outdoors really presents an opportunity for us to show what we do. And then as far as the, the reaching out to young people is we want people to look at our lenses and not just think of the functional benefit and the protection, but recognize that it doesn't have to compromise who they are. You know, I think these are pretty stylish and you know, I'm obviously in transition thing. <laughs> and so we want people to feel like they can wear this product, have all those great benefits and look good wearing it too. Right. Terrific. Uh, and uh, what I've learned, uh, well, is Transitions has always sort of positioned itself as a, as a resource for uh, certainly the retailer, uh, but this year particularly, you guys have positioned yourselves as, as a resource and a content provider so that ECPs can reach out to those, so that they themselves can reach out to those uh, younger consumers. Can you talk a little bit about where ECPs can get that kind of information sure. and what it is? Um, so just to back up what you said, absolutely, content is king. You heard me say mm -hmm. that in my speech. And so for us, we feel like if we can create a lot of that compelling content, whether it's images of people in our lenses, whether it's messages explaining why blue light is important, that's the first step, but then we want eye care professionals to be able to access it. So actually last year we created something called the Customer Hub, and it's just a hub of all of this content, and each of our lens caster partners have access to it. So all independent eye care professionals can go to their lens caster partners and ask for access to all of this information, but we can actually create hubs for large practices as well, so that's something that they can ask their lens caster or sales rep for and if it makes sense for them um, we absolutely will do it and sometimes we even work with individual ECPs if they have their own social media platform and they want to share the content we provide we absolutely encourage them to go to our Facebook page and really spread the word right this is great because social media is so important now and sometimes ECPs and retailers don't really know how to get started right now, so you can certainly help them and, and give them the right messaging exactly to attract uh, transitions um, customers um, and you talked a little bit in in uh, one of your presentations uh, during Academy, um, how tr Transitions Lenses appeals to um, the Millennials uh, particularly because of both their functionality as well as um, fashion, uh, especially with the new graphite green uh, color and whatnot. Um, 
I was wondering if you could just let us know or give us some give ECP some strategies how they can reach out to their own customers and re reach those their own younger customers and turn them on to transition. Sure, I think it's just about doing exactly that. What we did in our testing is we first exposed them to the benefit. And particularly when we expose them to the blue light benefit in the context of their busy digital lifestyles, they really connected with it. But then when you show them the product, you want to show them how good it looks and make sure the images that you're displaying it with or the frames that you're showing it with are really, really cool and fit with them. You know, a lot of the questions that we get when we talk with young people is, does it work with every kind of frame? Yes, you don't have to compromise. And then let them have fun with it. Let them see that, you know, if you're choosing brown, maybe a, a, tur a, a turquoise flame, I think I said that wrong, would go. But, you know, if you're choosing graphite, green maybe another mm -hmm. kind of frame mm -hmm. and so they can mix it up and they really start to have fun with the product too awesome. and graphite green is so popular yeah that, absolutely you know, yeah. That that, that's well. exactly why we did it and we're working on on considering other colors as well to really get that personal style celebration with with people okay. and on our products okay. so. many colors of transition awesome. <laughs> thank you i like that maybe we'll use it you got it you can you heard it here first <laughs> um a lot of uh Talk to me just a little bit about how ECPs can, if they're interested in attending this, um, how they can, uh, you know, how they do they earn their their trip I will before you answer I will share one quick thing that I was talking to an ECP uh, right before the awards presentation and she said to me she said you have to try really hard to not learn something here <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. and it's true so how do how did how does an ECP get here so we haven't formulated the specifics of how we're gonna do it next year but just at a 30,000 foot level the concept is always if you are celebrating transitions, being an advocate for transitions, that's what we want. We want you to get that message to your peers and extend your network. And if you're doing that in a visible way, we're gonna hear about it, but certainly share that with your, your rep and ask them what is transitions doing next year to decide who should come to Academy and, and really just ask those questions. And as we kind of always debrief after these events and figure out what's the best way, but our goal is to motivate and inspire more people to rally behind that brand. So if you're an advocate, you make sure that we know about it by just being out there and really spreading the word. Great, great, that's that's terrific. And I'd like to thank you for having I Care Business here every year. Uh, I personally learn a lot. We all get so much from, from Academy, so thank you. And thank you for your time, and I look thank forward to you. next year. Thank you very much. <laughs>